So, Slimbridge nil, Taunton Town won. Another good run out, good, you know, another victory in the pre season, Rob. What do you make of the 90 minutes? Uh, a very good test tonight. I thought, that, I thought they, were, they were good. They had a good little shape about them. They, they worked hard and for 90 minutes, you know. So, um, it was good. A lot of positives. A lot of positives. You know, we won. You know, it's, it's important to win for me. It's very important that we win. Um, and we have some momentum. And there was a lot of good things tonight, you know. Still pre season, we're halfway through it. And, you know, we're going to rapidly step things up in the next two or three weeks. And, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, I was pleased. I was pleased tonight. I was pleased. Yeah, I mean, well, you say you hesitated there a little bit. Just, do you feel like you were in control for the whole night? I think we were, in fairness to, you know, it's very difficult playing against the teams. We came and we dominated the ball and we've dominated possession for, for 90 minutes. I thought they had a good 10 minute spell at the end mm -hmm. and uh, where they actually decided to have a little bit of a go and, and, they, and they, they did really well. Yeah. But, <clears throat> excuse me, we... Um, you know, we, we've got to finish teams off. Definitely. You know, we've got to finish teams off. We had enough chances. You know, we've hit the post twice and the bar once and, you know, yeah. another day. But we can't have another day. It's not good enough. You know, no. it's, uh, but we had a lot of the ball, a lot of possession. We've got to learn that we have to break teams down at times and, and be a bit clever and better with our pass selection and our and the quality of our passing and the quality of our finishing. Mm. But, listen, we had to dig it for the last yeah. 10 minutes. They had, they had a real go and it just showed. I thought Marco was superb, you know, made a couple of great saves. And uh, all in all, yeah, it's a very good workout, very well. The well. yeah. surface is nice, a lovely place, yeah. the music's fantastic. What more can you ask? For? Exactly. And uh, I suppose it was nice to have the, the full team, you know, back for, for, for yeah. today. Yeah, good to have Benno back. You know, obviously, we're only missing really Jay, who's, who's had his um, trial extended mm -hmm. at Swansea. Um, so, uh, yeah, we're nearly, we're nearly back to it. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, but better come on and obviously still feeling a little bit of effects of, of COVID, which the other two boys are still, you know, I don't mm. think it's so much in their legs. It sounds like, you know, it gets to their lungs yeah. uh, and, and it's quite tough, but they've got a couple of 90s in them now. So hopefully they'll be the right side of it. Yeah, definitely. And I suppose, you know, I'd like to take a look at some of the specific players, maybe just during pre-season, a couple of these interviews. Um, Zach Smith, our number 16, how do you think he, and do you think he will be very instrumental, you know, with his reintroduction from Bristol? Do you think for the yeah, season going? Yeah, a super player. There's a few, there's a few things to, to uh, you know, he hasn't quite signed yet, but um, there's a few little hurdles we have to get over. But listen, Zach's a super player, you know, and I thoroughly, th thoroughly believe that he should be in the full-time game. It's a bit of a funny landscape for young lads who have been released yeah. from clubs at the moment. And uh, but you know if we can take advantage of that and we can help him get back into the full time game mm. on a short term basis, that's fine. But I thought he was good tonight again. You know I thought he was good. You know he, he gives us something different. You know technically he's superb. His, his engine's excellent. You know he's a lovely boy, lovely humble lad. You know yeah. and, I, and I'm, I'm a big fan of this. Good. And as we look forward to chipping them on Friday, I mean the traffic's not going to be great coming up the you know M5 on a Friday, but hopefully the football is. So what do you make of Friday's game? Uh, listen, another step in quality. You know we're, we're, we're the underdogs and they're a very good side. They've got a good manager. They're they're a really good club. Um, so yeah, looking forward to that because I'll, I think I will have a bit more of an idea exactly where we are. Um, again, we'll be we'll be pretty much everybody will be available. I don't think we've got any real injuries tonight. And uh, yeah, well, I'll have an idea where we are then, which is which is going to be good. Brilliant. All right. Cheers, Rob. Thanks very much. Thanks, mate.